very big annoyance. Uh, so what do you put know about this matchup? Uh, Rob's pretty comboable, and she she digs that. Uh, but then, as always, Rob just wants to try to space it out, and she can kind of try to needle back. Rob's but got Rob's the reflector are still too. Better. Yeah, yeah. This will be interesting. Rob's no. got that crazy aerial, like almost dash dance yeah, yeah, yeah. going on with that side B too. He's a crazy character. Is, I'm excited for this. I don't think I've ever seen this matchup. Detta doesn't come out as much as maybe everyone would like mm -hmm. him to come out. Yeah. I, I think it was ever since Knight started talking smack to him on the Facebook page. Oh, <laughs> he yeah. was like, you know what? I'll come out and prove why I deserve to be on the PR. That's hilarious. <laughs> we'll keep talking smack till yeah, he comes out absolutely. more. Absolutely. <laughs> That's I totally agree with that. There's nothing wrong with a little bit of healthy s uh -huh. smack talk. Now, I wonder if we'll see the Game & Watch at all today. I know that chat was talking about it when I was over there by Joe. I do like... Uh, Game and Watch. It's yeah. just such an entertaining character. It is. It's just like, oh, hey, I have a chair. Now I have a hammer. Now I have a pothole. I don't know how Who you knows fight. What? How do you fight Game and Watch though? Like, so from our perspective, like our angle, we see that whole those two dimensions. Yeah. But from the character's angle, he doesn't because he doesn't have the third dimension. Yeah, yeah. So thing. they're they're like looking at like a piece of paper. Some of the all times, they see is a line. And sometimes, like, if they're actually fighting in a three dimensional world, they would be able to turn and stuff. So sometimes you could see him, but other times he'd be thin as paper. But all his moves would look the same yeah. though, you yeah. know, because you're it's only strange. seeing one side of it. You know, is that a chair or is that a flaming <laughs> pick or a box of uh, whatever is in yeah, that box. Yeah, the box. <laughs> it's, just, it's just a box. <laughs> Sudden parachute just out of the sky. Oh, weird. Cool. Alright, so here's our first uh, neutral play. Mm -hmm. Already trying to set up that wall, as we know Rob loves to do. Okay, looking like he's got like decent combos and follow-ups mm -hmm. off of that uh, side B. Crouch cancels in order to. Oh, down look at that! Him. Just the way it just falls down. Yeah, and I think that Mystery tried to go for a grab on it, and it just led to a harder punish because he was unsuccessful on it. I know Mystery used to play some Diddy too, so he should be pretty good with items. Yeah, like he, he's definitely very familiar with uh, the glide tossing mechanics and, and catching items. Mm -hmm. So at least he has that going for him. But it doesn't look like he has too much experience just playing Rob. Yeah, and another thing that you'll notice about Mystery's uh, gameplay is he likes to crouch cancel like almost everything, and uh, it's just it's every not DM player. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not exactly the best against Rob. He can catch you with a lot of stuff. Ooh. Living up to 159 are, though. His forward airs are just beefy. Just clubsy with those. Oh my god! Caught him with an air. That was a up up air. Oh, okay. he's got that hitbox in front of it too. Really great. Just covers a lot of options. Down smash. Everyone's favorite move in brawl. The casual players. <laughs> Great catch and forward air out of it. That was nice, Mr. U. Like you were saying earlier, the item familiarity. Oh, did not think that would kill off nice. the top. Great right surprise. How, what is, uh, where is Rob's fall speed? It seems like pretty floaty. Yeah, it, which is weird since he's like a giant robot. He'd think he'd be pretty heavy. But, yeah, he does seem on the floatier half of the cast. Oh, is that, okay, he's, he's all right. I don't know. I think he's just got that new carbon fiber uh, system going on, so he's uh, energy efficient. Uh, you know, gotcha. very light. Good for the environment. And that's why he's like able to like do so much crazy stuff, like regenerate fuel so fast. That's how and he shoot accelerates lasers. so quickly. Mm -hmm. it's, just, it's green, green technology. <laughs> Learn it, love it, everyone. Oh, nice back air. Yeah, great edge guard for Mystery is coming out so far. It's showing that he can adapt pretty quickly. Those edge guards do look pretty, oh. pretty, pretty nice on Rob though. He doesn't have any, anything to make him like too intangible while he's trying to recover. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh wow. Ooh, Very barely close misses on that. snipe. Just putting that dreidel out always right in front of him. Oh, nice dacus. I'm just punching the, <laughs> punching the dreidel. Just <laughs> yeah, just gets rid of it. <laughs> that was pretty nice though. He threw it at Detta about three times before he was just like, and I don't need this anymore. I dealt my 30% with it already. I don't really know what the strategy is on that because uh, like when I play against Diddy Kong, I don't want to throw the banana off stage because then he can just pull out another one. I want to 
keep the banana just out of play or under my control. Wow, nice back air. Um, I don't know how it how it quite like proper strategy. Yeah. yeah, I didn't play enough brawl. Item game is certainly lacking. Hmm, almost looks like Rob was going to be a bit of combo meat there for a double up air, but it's a good thing that's not a true combo at that high of a percent. Oh, nice back air. Drop zone. Mm -hmm. Classic Sheik right there. Yep. Looking pretty nice uh, to edgeguard Rob, though. Yeah, Rob's just really big and uh, not a lot of great like frame data, so Sheik's oh. frame four moves are going to just eat him up in the air. Yeah, so, so here, here we go right here. Oh, he makes it back on. Get the fair out fast enough and get that acceleration going to side B. Really trying to put that dreidel right in the middle of uh, Miss's recovery. Uh huh. It's great. It can like if you place it on the ledge properly, it can cover an option. So if you're covering neutral get up with the dreidel, well, now you as yourself can cover the roll get up or something. Oh, nice. Really good options. Oh, he's going for the transport. Zelda. Oh, oh not gonna happen. Uh, now he's just gonna have to use up his invincibility to turn back into Sheik, which is a little disappointing. It's so fast though. It is, and it's like unpunishable, which is insane. Like, you have invincibility throughout the entire transformation, and then you can act the second you transform. <laughs> so... Oh. Explains how so many people have tried to punish it, and then just ended up getting, you know, combo Oh, grabbed, and, and then... Or forward aired. Oh, nice forward air. All right, he's off stage. How can he edge guard him, though? Just w he's got wait, control waits out all of too. his options, and then, yeah, gets the top. Oh, nice fair. Get him off of him. Rob's starting to put up that wall. Oh, oh. hits the... Hits yeah, it, that forward air... It. At 137%, that would have had quite a, knock, a bit of knockback oh, on man, that. Oh man, that up smash was really going for it. Mm -hmm. I'd like to see Rob grab the ledge maybe a little bit, because I know that it might not be one of the best things for Rob, but Sheik's, if, if yeah. Sheik has to land on stage, it's just not Very great punishable. Sheik. Yeah, and I would imagine that if Sheik lands close enough to the ledge, Rob would be able to get like a drop jump back air, or maybe not back air, forward air, Nair even, Nair's a great kill move. Yeah, I would like to see him going off stage more. He's just trying to set up camp with his projectiles, and it's not working. I'm also not a Rob man. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh, missing. Going for the... Oh, nice. Um, Great ledge game. Missed. Oh, oh, gets the trade. Yeah, he was out of... Uh, it's a good a, thing he was DIing the right way. Yeah. <laughs> that could have gone real south real quick. Mm-hmm. Way to hold DI Sent in, to the which is good because he was also... Did he throw a back air or a forward air? Yeah, it was a back air. So it was smart of him to throw the back air and then hold in because if he was still holding out from the back air, that would have killed that spike. Oh, yeah. Is it is it a spike or a, a tree spike? Oh, oh, I wouldn't be able to tell you, actually. Yeah, Rob's down. Ah, Maybe we'll be uh, lucky enough, unlucky enough for Mist to be able to witness it firsthand. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see, does anyone in chat know? Is what is Rob's down air? It's a meteor. Okay, meteor. thank All you. Right, cool. Thank you, Quonsters. There you go. Very you just, you just have the Twitch page open on your phone yeah, in your pocket always. Okay. Yeah, it's actually working now. Was messing up the other day. Those stream monsters. We got a lot of them in the co smash scene. I can't see how many viewers we have though. It's hard. It was like. No. 15 yeah, they're, they're pretty, pretty sweet. Their app is questionable. All right. What kind of stage do you think he's going to want to go to? Uh, I wonder if he's keeping the Game & Watch counter pick in mind. Ooh. Because if he can, he, it gives Game & Watch the opportunity to tech chase the Sheik as well, but he also dies to forward air sooner. Oh, no, just sticking with Rob. Okay. Yeah, I was thinking a big stage, because yep. he's got big kill moves, and he doesn't have to worry about getting edge guarded by Sheik as much, just because the ledges are so much farther away. And the projectile game. Yeah. He's just going to be able to go wherever he wants, keep throwing those tops. He's going to have to be ready for Mystery U to start using him against him, though. Oh, just those needles. Look at that full damage right there. Getting in. Is that fair? Wow. It doesn't uh, get that right there, that Nair. Very slow, but very powerful. Kind of like a, like a Charizard sort of thing. Just like this huge hitbox that goes yeah. everywhere. Ooh, great snipe. Not going to get much out of it, but it, it looked pretty. Oh, 
Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, getting a little hungry there on the ledge. Miss dropped him too soon. Mm -hmm. Oh, he <laughs> oh, did hit to the, the stage other side. <laughs> Oh, wow. Just combo food for, for Sheik. She can just... Even at 150 or so, she was able to down tilt into up air. And that's, that's going to kill. But on most characters, like Game and Watch, that one in the Venetry combo. Might have been able to up you out, too. Mm -hmm. It's Rob really trying to just get his space, get Sheik off him. Oh, nice Z-drop. Yep, that's and gonna that's going to be a stock. We had been seeing Detta use the top to cover an, a get-up option, so it was good to see him mix it up and cover the recovery option itself. Wow, throws that straight at Sheik's face and just <laughs> missed. Yep, uh, Legend Invincibility was still on, I guess. Ah, okay. Tries to kick the top instead of uh, wave land and grab it. Mm -hmm. I don't know uh, the data on Sheik's throw animation. Oh, wow, wow, great wow. needle snakes. It's not really too much of a gimp. He's at like 130. <laughs> Oh, the, the, the top stuff just jumped yeah, there. That yeah. was... <laughs> I, I think Mr. Yu might have been going for a grab on it, because he did jump just straight into it, so... He was probably trying to grab it, and it just didn't work out twice. Oh, uh, okay. Jeez, he can close the distance so fast with the fly toss. Mm -hmm. Oh, here we go, needles. Oh, needles. Yep. Alright, at least he... Fortunately for him, it knocks him back on stage, but he's still more percent. And he can trade right now, because he is a up. Power shields on lasers, that was, that was nice looking. Oh my gosh. Just how does how do you get close to Rob? Yeah, he even used the laser to get the extra hit on his own top to send it back. Otherwise he would have been punished by his own top. But great snipes as well from Detta. Still behind in this match though. Uh oh. Up air does 20%. Wow. Oh, ouch. Learned something new. That hurt a bit to see. I don't even know if that was every hitbox of up air. Because up air does have a lot of hitboxes. Yeah. Mm, looks good, though. Oh, going for that. I've seen Detta do that a few times when he's trying to get down or get back to on get back to stage. Oh, oh my, god. my god. I didn't know he had one more still. Uh, does he get ref Does he get more if he gets a needle it, during it? It goes up to three. Uh, I know that, but I wasn't sure. Like The third one takes a bit longer to build than the other ones, I feel like. Oh, d he doesn't get more if he gets hit out of his up B? No. Okay. Oh. Oh. Wow. Nothing. Oh, no, there it He's is. done. That's all right. Nice this, is, this is currently Detta's tournament stock, though. So hopefully He's he can to... find a way to maybe send this to game three. I'm Chain grabs. I'm thinking there's going to be a lot of running away and shooting stuff. Unfortunately, for both sides. Yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> Sheik has some pretty sweet uh, needles, too. Okay. Percent, percent. This is good. He just needs to find the kill a bit oh, soon. Oh, there it is. Yep. Oh, wow. wow. Like, to the percent. Maybe a little better DI and he would have lived, but also maybe, like, 3% less and he would have lived. That is beastly. Mm -hmm. Gets it. Falls down with it a lot. Yeah. Just because it's really hard to challenge it because it is so powerful. So people, you just got to get out of the way. Yeah, and it's a huge hitbox, too. Like, it covers all his sides. Oh, right there again. Although, he shield grabs it. It's not safe on shield, apparently. Yeah, there it is again. Oh, Ooh, wow. Dash dance grabs. So fast. Oh, no. Bounces. Oh, if Detta would have just held the ledge, that's the kill for him. That's the mix-up he, he went for. Wow, this is a crazy game. Yeah, Detta definitely pulling oh, this one wow. back, looking for Very green three. Very close on the top. He did the same thing against Keo. He was down, losing by quite a bit, and uh, he pulled it back. So, oh, Detta showing, little... showing that he's clutch. Get three percent. Why not? He just has that patience. I, I think part of it is missed is just he doesn't want to sit back. There's definitely a few times where I just think if he sat around and just charged up his needles. Yeah, you know? it would have been. An like, advantage for him. You don't, you don't gotta... Oh! How many up does that... Okay, we made it. Oh! Wow, very close. Nice up air. Challenging the, the Nair. Yeah. Not something you see all the time. And coming out on the winning side of it, too. Usually, if you challenge it, it doesn't work out too well for you. Detta is surgical with these lasers, though. Off the ricochet, too. Oh, that's gonna, that's gonna be it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 
Wow. 2 0 from Mist. Yeah, um, it looked like Dedda had DI'd in on the down throw, which at that high of a percent, a DI away. I don't think the forward air is super guaranteed. Maybe a bit harder to hit. I don't know.